Hello everyone. So I just wanted to make a really quick video showing how to kind of troubleshoot gear shifting on your outboard. This is a 1996 40 horsepower Evernrude and this bottom handle is the shifting and the top is the throttle. I'm not really going to go too much into the throttle in this, in this video, but I just want to show kind of what I learned and what I first did wrong with kind of troubleshooting the gear shifting. Now, uh, a while ago our motor essentially would not go into reverse and what I did is when I hooked up the shifter cable, I tried to turn this little adjuster to kind of get the cable to push the shifter further back or either direction to kind of get the shifting into place. And this is actually incorrect, as the cable should pretty much be aligned perfectly, so when it's in neutral, it should just sit directly into the hole. This is because, unlike the throttle, where when you push the cable, the throttle goes slowly in and out. So for example, if you adjust the cable a little bit, it will make a difference in the way it works. But the way the shifting actually works, it doesn't move slowly, it is basically like a popping action. It pops into place, so like that. That's forward or reverse, then neutral, and forward or reverse, I forget which one is which. But as you can see, this is why adjusting the throttle cable itself just slightly won't really do anything. And if essentially popping the gear into forward or reverse, it doesn't work. You likely have an issue inside the actual controller or most likely inside the gearbox down below. And this is what ended up happening with our motor. The thrust bearing for reverse essentially got broken and it was not in place. Thus the reverse gear would not move close enough for it to switch correctly. And this is why even when you try to switch it, it would kind of do a bunch of clicking and it, it just didn't sound right. But for a while, I made the mistake of trying to think that maybe you could you know, adjust this lever a little bit to fix the situation. But this is not true, so when you put in the shifter cable, what you want to do is put a little bracket into the hole, and then you want to twist this so that the hole perfectly aligns with the shifting pin. And make sure your controller is obviously in neutral. And uh, one of the other reasons why you kind of want to do this in neutral is because neutral has a little bit of play in it, so that it kind of, the shift rod might wobble just a little bit, but then, once it's switched into either of the two gears, it really just kind of pops in. So there, there's no kind of in-between section, and if you're trying to troubleshoot this, this kind of understanding this, that this helped me a lot, and now our shifting works perfectly, but the issue is probably the gearbox and possibly the controller. And so the, the gear shift is much easier to set up than the throttle. I'll go into exactly how to tune the throttle in another video, but if yours isn't shifting right, it's a pretty simple simple check to see what's going on and if you can't shift in reverse for example you might just if you don't want to fix the gearbox or look into it further you could just not use it but don't try to fiddle with this controller or this adjustment here as it might actually make everything worse.